Hey guys, um, I'm here with Chelsea Harden with Permanent Impressions and we're going to be doing a lash lift and tint and then also, is it an eyebrow tint? Yeah. Is that what it's called? Yeah. So she's just going to um, show us the process and I've never had a lash lift before so I'm really excited about that. Um, Chelsea is actually the one that did my microblading and um, yeah, so I'm really excited to have another service from her. All right, I'm gonna start just by combing your lashes and getting them ready. Okay. So you were noticing that my lashes are like really blonde. Mm hmm So do you think, and actually they're really, really straight. Yes, that's another thing I noticed. Yeah, like if I am not that person that can wear mascara without curling my lashes, so right. I'm really excited about this. Mm hmm So do you think that I'm a pretty good candidate for this? Yes. I think what you're going to notice the most is is that because your the tips of your lashes actually where it gets really light blonde, it will make the biggest difference. Okay. I'll have you close your eyes at this point. Mm -hmm. The next step, I'm just going to glue the rod on, and then I'll work your lashes onto the rod. So you actually glue like a little perm rod onto yes. my eyelid? Mm -hmm. That is crazy. Yes. I mean, you get it all glued on, and then you it's just a, you know, it's systematic so it's not much different from person to person other than the size of the rod okay so there are different sizes yep small all the way to extra large Ooh. well when I can open my eyes I want to see them. Mm -hmm. so what size did you use on mine large because your lashes are actually really long so I can't see what are you using to put the lashes on the rod just like glue it's literally adhesive Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. It just, but it, it comes right off with water is the nice thing. So how often would I have to get this done? Well, um, it's every 12 weeks. Really? Yeah. That's a lot longer than I thought you were going to say. Yeah. It's up to 12, so you know how that goes. Yeah. It depends how well you're, I don't, you know, everyone's lashes are so different. Kind of like, mm -hmm. you know, we know skin, hair is different, so. Mm -hmm. So is it basically, you know, when these lashes start to fall. fall out and we get new ones and well I think that the curl just falls I mean oh really you know yeah well it's just like a perm the curl stays not as curly yeah that's hilarious a teeny perm yeah so you actually go right in the center you want to be careful of not getting the base you know of the lash mm. where the hair the, like where the it comes from yeah. and the tips because the tips can frazzle so what is this you're putting on again? This is the lift lotion. This is the actual perm solution. Okay. So this is what sets for seven minutes? Yep. So now I just use a little bit of water and I just literally wipe this off really gently and then I add the second step, which would be like your neutralizer. Mm -hmm. Okay, so this step's done. You have a permed eyelash. Cool. I feel like they even look darker because you yes. can see the underside now. Yep. That's and you crazy. will notice these lashes on this side were naturally shorter. So that's really like, kind of like microblading. They're a little bit different. Things like you're are out of your control. Is that is that normal to have oh, one yeah. side shorter than oh, the yeah. other? Oh yeah, and sometimes people have little like spaces. So when it, after you lift, it looks like you like they lost lashes, but it's you're just because like, no, they're no, up. No, it's just like, it's like that. literally just how their lashes were to begin with. Yeah. Wow. Okay, so we just finished up with the lash lift 
tint and eyebrow tint. She also shaped my eyebrows um, with wax and tweezing. And I've got to say that I think that that was like a really easy process, first of all. Um, the lashes took not very long. I mean, About I feel like it minutes. was... Yeah, the whole process was like, what, 45 minutes total. Yeah. And I mean, besides waxing, it's it doesn't hurt at all. I... I would definitely recommend it. I'm loving my dark brows and hoping that I don't have to fill in quite as much. And I can already tell a difference. We'll do a side by side later, but I can tell a big difference in um, my lashes and I don't even have mascara on. So these are them tinted and um, with no uh, eyelash curler. So that's a big win for me because mine are very, very light. How does the pricing work? Like is the lash lift and tint a one price thing or just talk about the pricing yeah so if you get it together it's 95 and then if you just the lash lift and tint yes okay just for lashes and the tinting of the lashes is okay. 95 if you decide you just say like I'm gonna wear mascara every day so I want to just lift them just the lift yeah it's 80 80 okay so 80 dollars and then 15 for your tinting and then it'd be 15 additional dollars for your eyebrows so I do 15 for the tint of the brows. So it's a total of 110? Yes. 110 for, for this. Okay. Yeah. Chelsea is offering a free lash tint or brow tint with the purchase of a lash lift for my 11th Street Beauty followers. Just mention 11th Street Beauty during booking and make sure to book before the end of 2018 to lock in this special price. Thanks, Chelsea. You're so welcome. <laughs> this is really, really fun. Um, that's all I have. <laughs>